Hello, July 17th. We are not having to wait that long to witness a financial meltdown here in America. Uh, this is after hours. Bear Stearns, you might have heard, has a couple troubled hedge funds. Bear uh, today closed at 139.91. Then after the market closed, here's the announcements. Here's the latest. 7.13 p.m. Bear credit hedge funds almost wiped out, sources say. A Bear Stearns uh, company's hedge fund that made leveraged bets in the subprime mortgage market is worth nearly nothing, according to two people briefed by the investment bank. An update two minutes later, 7.15 p.m., Bear Stearns say troubled funds have very little value. So Bear Stearns is down uh, about $5 a share in after hours trading. Bottom line as far as how this goes and why I don't work for a conventional bank because you got to be rah-rah, bullish. Well, it's a bearish time. So if you had uh, Bear Stearns July 135 options that expire on Friday, you could have bought them today for $0.60. Cents. And uh, you watch in the morning, they'll be probably worth 2 or $3, which would be five times your money, 500% in 24 hours or less than 24 hours. That's what's going on in the real world of financial uh, markets. Let me read you this from CNN Money. Uh, if you have access to the internet, I'd go to CNN Money and read it. You're watching the financial collapse happen before our eyes. Um, this is uh, from CNN Money. Two Bear Wall Street Journal, uh, quoting a Dow Jones News Service article, two bear funds nearly worthless investors told. Weeks after the meltdown of two prominent Bear Stearns hedge funds that bet heavily on the market for risky home loans, the brokerage has told funds investors that the portfolio's assets are almost worthless, according to people familiar with the matter. The assets in Bear's more levered fund, the high-grade structured credit strategies enhanced leverage fund, quite a name, are worth virtually nothing, according to people familiar with the matter. The assets of the other larger, less levered fund are worth roughly 9% of the value since the end of April. The April valuations weren't immediately available, but in March, before the sharp losses, the enhanced levered fund had $638 million in investor money, while the other fund had 925. million. The two funds have been in the spotlight for weeks after suffering heavy losses in the subprime market. Last month, Bear helped stabilize a less levered fund with a $1.6 billion secured loan. The enhanced fund began trying to unwind its remaining $1.1 in debt. A billion dollars gone, okay? Gone. This is real. This financial collapse is real, okay? Like I said, I have a heavy financial background, very heavy financial background, and I feel I could debate this with anybody on the planet. In fact, I know I could. But I'm just telling you, uh, you might not be as financially sophisticated, but you have, if you have the gut feeling that, that you know what's going on, okay? It's just happening. Okay? If you want to study it, go to CNNMoney.com. Read the articles for yourself right now. The Dow is down 62 points in after hours trading. Tomorrow will be a down day. That's an easy to see prediction. It's mathematical. It's real. Tomorrow should be interesting to watch the markets go for it. I'm wound up because it's going to be a big day tomorrow. Uh, watch it. We're watching the financial clap before our eye. Fan the financial claps before our eyes. For me, it's exciting to predict it, see it, and uh, watch it. So, Hope you watch it with me, and uh, be bearish. It's the way to go, because it's the real way to go, and there's a way to, to make money and have fun. Bulls are full of, um, you know what? Okay, God bless. Bye.